You brother, you are the newest member. Yeah, nigga. To the NMD club. Fuck yeah, bro. Next member of the collection. That's what I'm trying to the tell him, nigga. Of NMD. NMD, nigga. The brand with three stripes. Three stripes, you bitch. Are the newest member. Woo. And you are made where you can be fancy. Fancy, bitch. I'm fancy. Going out, partying. I'm fucking partying, bitch. Shit lit. You can go for comeback. I'm ready for comeback. Ooh. You can deal. Look at you. You have a special thing underneath. But you are NMD. You got that special underneath, nigga. For the ruggedness. You can go through water. I'm fucking rugged, nigga. All my style. You're bigger than us. I'm bigger than all these motherfuckers. The NMD family. All of us now must take the off. I take this off seriously. Seriously, bitch. Three stripe brand. NMDs for life. NMDs for life. NMDs for life. NMDs. NMDs for life. Yeah. Introducing. That little Negro, Dre. Hey, what's up, Mama? What's up, Mama? Hey, I love all y'all brothers and sisters out there, man. We got another unboxing today, bro. Hey, we got the ass beads, baby. Yeah. And it's in every color. So, you know, if you prejudice, we got all tight, bro. For you, okay? Your personal has beads, bro. We can customize it and everything, bro. And hey, you're gonna like that shit because it's made of good quality. You see what I'm saying? The best thing for your assholes. So, right now, we're gonna show the unboxing of the latest beads. Thank you. And good night. I got. Now, the ass beads. They are good. Them ass beads are good. Now, I tried it out, and they made my ass feel special. My ass was feeling all tingly. Them shits feel good. So when they go in, it's like, they can quiver a little bit. You're like, ooh, shit, you, like, you want to, you know, grab on to something. And when you pull it out, I had to test it, nigga. I had to take one for the team. I got to test it before I fucking try to sell shit and explain shit to y'all niggas. The ass beads is great, bro. My personal one, Black Magic and Black Thunder. So, I, we got it all, baby. And these are good for all the dick riders. See, I told you I got y'all niggas. All you dick riders, I got y'all. So, this is good for y'all dick riders, all right? Okay, peace now. Get your dick out of my mouth. Hola, hola. Well, today we have another unboxing, courtesy of the friendly people out there in the theater. And uh, this right here is a lady sneaker, but. I like the silhouette, and I figured maybe to be one of the ones that could be like a unit set. So let's see what I got here. First of all, these came out first in August, and that was to the European market first, and then the did with us out here in the U.S. I don't know the time actually when it came to the U.S. But it's been out before. Uh, the pack. I guess I could cut off the music, but I'm not gonna cut it off. I forgot what the pack was called for the girls. I'll write it down in the, on, on the comments what the pack was called. I mean, uh, put it out in a uh, in a title. So. That's what the box saying. 
I forgot what, like I said, what they, what they call these girls ones. What was the thing? I think it was not. It's something like how the glitch was for the men. I forgot what they call this one. But this just came out. As far as uh, restocking it again, they just came out. And they were on Adidas. And I did not know. So sometimes I'm noticing with Adidas lately. And uh, finish line today. Finish line, I dropped some NMDs and some... Um, Ultra Boost, the one with the black Ultra Boost underneath, which I would have loved to get. Mundano Rock Ultra Boost, it was the uncaged one, the gray with the black, um, um, what you call it, boost bottom. So I would have liked that, but uh, I didn't see it. The time I woke up, it was already gone. These right here came out on, uh, like I told you, Adidas. I did not know that it was there. And uh, here it is called Colgate Net, um, uh, well, the, the, what you call it, the silhouette is uh, obviously, uh, what you call it, XR1. But uh, the color, we call it navy, I, mean, you know, I don't know why they keep putting all these different colors, but they call it, I think it's Colgate, how they say it, Colgate Navy, so the Colgate Navy. They say there's black in it. I really don't think this is like, I don't really see it as black. The design in it, I don't see it as black. Maybe like a darkish, Oh, now you, yeah, about a darkish gray, a little, little darker gray. Not charcoal gray, but a little grayish to me. The strings is like a bluish with a little uh, tan in it. As you see the the tail, I mean, um, the tongue. You can see how that look like a little suede. So that's cool. I like that. A little suede, little thing up on it. Switch it up, beat it up on it and suede. And then I like the stitching. I like the stitching on the thing. And that's what I think they should do on um, the NMD R1s when they do the three strikes. I think they should put stitching. Instead of, um, I call it heat pressed on. Instead of heat pressing the three uh, stripes, they should put it in stitching. But anyway, like I said, you got um, three um, three uh, shoestring lids, eyelids, three of them. So it's three. And, uh,. It's one whole um, prime knit. This is prime knit, so it's one whole prime knit. All the way from the tip, all the way to the tail, back of the tail. You got that uh, red uh, pull tab. They're saying these words right here. I think this one is Japanese. So if you're Japanese, you can correct me if not, but it's saying Japanese three stripes. They got this uh, pull tail, you know, the pull tab. I mean, the rubber piece in the back. They got it in rubber. Not rubber, thick as rubber. And it's not feeling like rubber either. It's feeling like a like a heavy patch, you know, like a patch on a tiger, feeling something like that. So I don't know. Maybe it could be like a, some type of plastic type leather feel. That's what I would call. It. Yeah, they do feel like plastic. Yeah, like a little plastic rubberish type feel. And then you see the cage that be on the um, XR1. And I actually like the XR1 model. Obviously, the hottest ones that's selling on, on the XR1 is um, Pharrell's. I never got my hands on it. You see, they got the white plug. And then on, the, on these right here, they didn't put a Dita on this side right here, like how they do on the R1. They don't say a Dita, and plus it's a little plug. It's a tiny little plug on there, not that big plug. And then the other side got that one standard plug like it always got on the other side of it. So that's how it is so far. I'm gonna wipe my face because I'm burning up. And I've been drinking coffee. So. Yeah, so yeah. I said let me go ahead and try it because it was a girl. And this is a size 11. It only goes up to 11 in girls. So I'm a 10 and a half in men. So I said, let me try and see if it'll fit. Maybe probably need 11 and a half, but I said maybe these fit big. So let's see, I'm gonna try it in 11. I actually like it. And I think to me it's more, you can rock it as a dude color. You don't have to necessarily feel like it's a girl color. They got the red underneath up under here again. Saying in Adidas. And you know, you got the, what I call um, fishnet. Got the fishnet holes in it. And then at the heel, at the back of the heel, 
then there's no um, holes in it. And then in the front of the, um, the shoe, the toe top, there's no um, holes in it. So that's that's just traditional on all the um, NMD models that I've seen. I don't remember it on the um, Chuck of TR. The C1s, TRs, I don't remember how it was again. But I did that. You can check on my video. I don't remember how the back of it. I don't even know if I even showed the back. But like I said, you see the cage in there. And uh, these are nice, bro. I actually wanted, when I first seen them, I actually wanted a glitch pack. I wanted a glitch pack. I tried to get it. I couldn't get it. And uh, I think maybe one time I could have, but I didn't, my credit card wouldn't go through. And I didn't know the other ones, so I didn't get it. So I said, let me try these girl ones. And let me bring it through. And like I said, I think guys could actually wear this. Uh, to me, it got that denim look. Like a denim. But it ain't denim. You know what I mean? But it's like a denim look up on there. So, I don't think it's too girly girly. I think guys can get away with it also. You can you can get away with it. So, that's it up on there. And like I said, it has um, three holes in the shoestring. Three shoestring holes. So, and then got the string there, and I told you got the, the thing there, and then like I said, it's all white, stitched out, all around, by the ankle, and uh, it's nice, I actually like it, yep, um, I actually like it, and these were um, 130, and like I said, it goes up to size 11, and I got these at Adidas, so you can check these out if you want to check them out, up on there. And I'm gonna throw back on the music and let it go and get back on there. But yeah, that's what it is, man. And to me, I'm gonna try them on, see how they feel. But I think actually, dudes can get actually get away with this. I think they can actually get away with it. You know what I mean? If you can wear pink, you can wear anything. And to me, it don't really look, it, you know, you know, blue, navy blue sometimes be looking like a purple too. It got that little, little purple taste too, but to me it's more like a, even though it looks like a little purple, it's still like a little bluish to me too, like I told you, like that denim look. Um, the cage part of the color is alright. I don't know if I'm trying to get it to match this a little bit better, but I don't think it is matching anyway, but. It's a little bit, maybe you couldn't get that color on over here for that the same way you got on the, on the tongue. They couldn't get for the cage, but they tried to come as close as possible. So they came with that color right there. I don't know what they call like a teal or steel, whatever they be calling that color. But yeah, like I said, man. And it's just a one foot. One, one whole uh, prime yet. 130, so it's there now if you want it. Or you want to get it for your lady. These right here are size 11. So once again, I'll be saying these NMDs, they don't really be looking to me big. Oh, that's a little like a little base there looking in the morning. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with it, but yeah. I don't like a little tiny little base or anything there. Because it's white, you can actually see it a lot. But yeah, that's it right here. The XR1 Prime Knit 11. Size 11, Adidas, go Adidas, we can go to Adidas, come and go get them. They're still there. A whole bunch of sizes. I think it starts from 5 to 11. I don't know how, how the women's sizes go. They go all the way to 11. All right, so I'm going to try them out. And I'll have the foot thing up in my foot tomorrow. I'm going to put my foot in there now because I don't want to stink it up. So. That's what it is. Until next time. Yeah. P.S. These are the glitch pack too. These are the glitch pack for the women. So they are the glitch pack. So obviously the glitch pack for the guys came in gray. And the, and the other color was like a, a charcoal gray. So they had like a light whitish gray. With black like a little um, zebra-ish color. And then uh, over here, and then they had the, um, the dark charcoal gray. And for the girls, they came up with this one. And then they came out with another grayish color. All right, so I'm out.
What, nigga? Alright. The fucking shoestrings, they reflective. They reflective like your girl pussy. You see? Your bitch pussy shining, baby. Baby, your pussy glowing. You got the golden touch. A thousand subscriber gets a pack of free dicks. Pack of free dicks. First thousand subscriber. Thank you. All right, nigga, get the fuck out. Come on. Y'all gotta get the fuck out. It's time to go, nigga. It's time to get the fuck out of here. You saw everything we got. You sold all the skits. Now get the fuck out of here. All right? Peace, nigga. And thanks for watching.